spire in the very front. But I noticed that every time people would come in, he'll reach to the back and give them the products. The one that had the longest expiration date. And finally, I, I realized it's not an accident. He's doing that on purpose. So I took him aside. I said, what are you doing? He said, we're selling a lot of products. I said, I know we're selling a lot, but you're selling the stuff on the back, man. Grab the stuff off the front. It, by the way, you, you, girls, you know this, because you shop in the stores. All the stores in the front, they put the stuff they want to get rid of first. Is that right? Yeah, everybody knows that. So why are you reaching in the back? He said, my religion teaches me this. You give the people the best that you have. What kind of religion is that? So, okay, let it slide, because we always sell it anyway. I'll sell the stuff on the front. You don't worry about it. But then someone bought a, a lot of merchandise and paid cash, and the change was not even a dollar. It was just coins, some coins. The lady, she left it laying on the counter and she went away. And she walked to the parking lot and she's about to drive away. And he saw this change. He grabbed it and he ran out the door and he's running and running, trying to catch her and tell her, you know, and he stopped the car and, and she rolled down the window, what's, what's, what's the matter? He said, you left your chain. She looked at him like, what? It's just a couple coins. You come out here, it was very hot sun that day. And look how he's sweating and everything. Here's your change. And when he came back, I said, what happened? He said, the lady forgot her change. I said, it wasn't even five cents. Maybe a dime or pennies or something, I don't know. He said, yeah, but I have to give it to her. I said, why? What's the problem? He said, in my religion, you have to do that. What kind of religion is this? Does it have an effect on you like that? And then he began teaching me some ayahs of Quran, translation. And when we would travel, he would say something about the hadith of Rasulullah, some of all, I think. 